Confirmed reports of an accident at Southland Park. I can't find my boy! Hundreds of family members gathered outside the deserted park today to commemorate the slaughter. Full investigation of the park's safety. Authorities report at least 30 deaths and close to 100 Five years since the tragedy closed the gates of Southland Park. But new evidence is claiming malicious prosecution. And believes Says he'll be he spent every penny of his fortune so defending Eagles himself Eagles from these lawsuits. Defending Southland Park over Joe Poppins. There were people flying everywhere. It was funny part. And the victim's Why? families oh have God. vowed to appeal the decision. What are you not guilty? Cleared of all charges. Shit, nigga. Divorce lawyers ain't gonna prosecute your bony black ass. Divorce lawyers don't do shit but fuck a brother over when his bitch run off. So you think your cracker's a cop or what? Man, I got to get my ass around some educated motherfuckers. Yeah, yeah. He probably a lawyer. What the fuck you looking at, cracker? I'm here to see Joseph Clarence. Never heard of him. Mr. Swing King? Oh. <laughs> Sorry ass dickhead. What the fuck they call you? Names of a friends, so I don't need one. <laughs> oh. Oh. Yeah, sure. Whatever you want. Mm -hmm. I've got the papers in my briefcase. Mm -hmm. That's your worldly shit, Jackson. I don't care. I'm doing God's work here, motherfucker. And your soul ain't got no motherfucking papers. I represent Mr. Swing King's wife. And here I am, about to light your ass on fire. I am just a lawyer. Bet you're a lawyer. Well, lawyers need purifying too. Mm-hmm. I'm just here to get his signature on their divorce papers. I'm covered in gas. Put that cigarette out. Don't hurt me. I've got one. What do you call the cracker motherfucker after sight goes through with him? What? A firecracker! Yeah, go on! Congratulations. Little help in here, guys! What the fuck happened 
here. Check you, white bread. All right, you cool. Shit, all fucked up. What the fuck? Fucking F. Shit, man. Somebody's got to fix this motherfucker. The lights! The lights! It's been a while now, uh, Scoop, and I was just wondering uh, where we were on the whole money thing. Were you? Yeah, see, the thing is, if you remember, you know what we agreed to was it'd just be a short while and you'd pay in cash and... And... Uh, I know the, what the pressure was you were under must be, but the deal is a deal and I was hoping, you know, maybe you could just pay what we agreed on, even though you've been here for... Heck... <laughs> More than twice as long as we agreed to, but, but just pay the original amount and move on. Not right away necessarily, but you know, I'd appreciate it. No. Ha! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> You looking fine today, bitch. What you got on underneath all that? Very, very little. Oh, yeah. Fine looking bitch like you don't need no fancy wrapping, do she? Depends who's unwrapping me. God damn, girl. I'd have your fine ass unwrapped before you could say, Who's that handsome stud on time I river? I bet you could. Oops. <laughs> That's Uncle Joe. Better get back to your post. I can get the money, sweetie. It's as good as mine already. Mr. Spook's got it. We'll open the park. It'll be like old times. No, no, just a few more days. You gotta believe me. Don't say that, sunshine. Mr. Spook's gonna come true, baby. He's good for the money. I won't sign the papers, I won't. You gotta give me one more chance, you gotta. Baby cakes? Sunshine? Hello? Oh. No. Yahoo! Please. Please. Cakes. You can't. I, I don't. <laughs> Who the hell are you? How'd you get in here? Carolyn! My client has hired me to show you this photograph. I don't understand. My client has asked me to ensure it's the last thing you ever see. Please, look at the photograph, Mr. Clarence. Oh. Don't you think I know how much suffering I'm responsible for? The guilt I feel. I'm so sorry. <laughs> 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 
I know I can never. All I want is a second chance. Everything I ever did, I did for love. Please. Come on, bitch. We got an intruder scoop. Some motherfucker busted in on Jay-Z's watch. You know, I don't like uninvited guests. But I remember what you were saying about playing it cool, yo. And I tried to play it cool, but the cracker got by me. That all. I see. It was my orders that caused the problem. Is that what you're trying to say? I ain't say that shit. I'd like to give you a lesson in personal responsibility, Jay. But seeing as there's an intruder on the premises, I'm a little pressed for time. Rick Henderson, first edition. He's expecting you. This way. Rick Henderson. I've been looking forward to this. As have I, Mr. Alexander. Don't let's stand on ceremony. Call me Jack. Rick. Make yourself comfortable, Rick. I'll be right with you. I admire your work. Real journalism. Thanks. I thought we'd start with your thoughts on the White House attack. Then discuss your tenure as director of the FBI, post-retirement reflections, whatever, and... Rick. Or if you want to sound off on politics... Rick. My apologies. This interview about me is just a cover for a more sensitive story. I'm sorry to have lured you here under false pretenses, but I couldn't risk a leak. I'm not sure I understand. Don't worry. It's the scoop of the century. If I had a dime for every time I heard that... Listen, please. It begins with a little incident at a vineyard in Chile that caught my eye some time ago. This was a family business. Fernando Delgado and his son Manuel. Well-liked, hard-working men. Have a look at the folder. 